You alright guys? Take one guess where I am. Take one guess. This is Louisa's. Louisa's four months old agua forest. I was here a couple of months ago, four months ago exactly, when we were planting this. Uh, you know, I've got a video, go back and watch that. You know, this was the area we had no green cover for the floor. It was just, you know, really dead soil. And we you know digging holes and just uh, basically planting seedlings of all large amounts of fruit. Uh, it's a coffee oriented system with a lot of palm hearts and citrus and everything. But look at all the matter. Remember we planted loads of them wild beans. Look at that wild bean there. Look at how nice it's come through. It's really popped out and thriving, and covering that soil. And look at the coffee. Yeah, it's like it's in a greenhouse. It's beautiful. It's like it's in a greenhouse here. Beautiful. All that wild bean there. Look at that beautiful corn coming through everywhere. Look at the corn. We didn't spray anything, not even organic permitted certified sprays, you know, all that pharmacy stuff where they're like, oh, this is authorized by the Organic Association, blah, blah, blah. We didn't spray nothing, it's just processes of life. Look at all that corn to harvest. Yeah, we really, I, I, I told her, let's harvest this corn and let's feed the chicken for the whole year worth of chicken food. And let's eat organic egg for real. Look at that, the eucalyptus coming through. We've got loads of little things coming through underneath here. Let's, let's, let's dig in, let's have a look at what's underneath here. Oh yeah, yeah look at that, it's vigorous coffee, it's vigorous, it's vigorous. We needed to do this, we needed to bring the green power, we needed to cover the soil with something. Let's have a look at here what we're doing. Okay, we've got more different types of wild beans here, all right, loads of different wild beans. And we've got the black beans, we, we, we're going to harvest black beans as well. Look at that here, let's open this baby here. This is black beans for harvest, uh, this is not quite ready, that one there is. Give that a poke and see what it's looking like. Uh, still not dry enough, but we're gonna open it now. Yeah, beautiful black beans coming through there. Can you see it there? Yeah, so she's, she's gonna harvest the black beans. Basically, now we're waiting for the harvest of the black beans. You can see there's lots of bean vines here. So we're gonna harvest these black beans. Can you see it there, the bean vines? Everywhere. We've got to harvest the black beans. They've done a great job for us. They've covered the soil. We even got to harvest the beans, the wild beans, because those seeds are really valuable as well. And look at all that timber wood that was planted here. This is like a greenhouse. Look at that. Timber wood. This is Jatoba. This is Baru nut. Ah, oh, lovely. So we've got all them cocktail of seeds coming through. All right. We've got the coffees planted here as well. The coffee's been well looked after. We've got the corn, we've got to have the cassavas. So really what we're waiting is for the harvest of these beans, for the corn, and then we're gonna come like a hurricane. We're gonna chop it all down, we're gonna cover the soil, we're gonna benefit all the fruit that we wanted. We've got a passion fruit everywhere here. I can see passion fruit popping up there. You can see the passion fruit here. But he's been so patient, this is the baby. He's been so patient. He's gonna really be climbing on the, on the eucalyptus and he's gonna be climbing on the, Guavas as well, I remember that. And we've got palm hearts everywhere. And look at that beautiful. This is a wild bean. We can't eat this, but uh, organic people, they love it. So it's got real value as well to harvest these seeds. Yeah, once again, look at that. Yeah, the coffee's really been looked after here. I'm loving it. Let's have a look outside. Guys, it's only been four months. It's only been four months. This was really uh, poor soil. This is real poor soil here. We had no matter to cover, no material, no green matter to cover. Look at all that power. We're in the forest. We're in Eloise's, newborn, loads of fruit, loads of veg, loads of beans, loads of corn. Yeah, all the veg, all the fruit coming through. Oh, I can't even get out. It's that dense. And it's all dense and it's, it's all rich stuff. It's all rich hydrogen fixing beans and everything. So, oh yeah, let's get out of here. Let's have a quick look. Wow, look at all of them bananas as well. There's gonna be so much harvest here. It really is exciting. And if that's not enough, that's the future. It's coming through over there as well. Eloisa, she's really brave. She's really brave. She's retired, uh, you know, she wanted to do this project and she's really brave. And it's only been four months. So this is the result. You know, it's all about the attitude. I salute Eloisa.